Hello, I'm Janet. Welcome to this lesson. We are going to learn about advertisement. Now, advertisement is a public announcement informing the public about something, maybe a product for sale or a service or an event or persuading people to do or to buy something. Advertising is the art of communicating what a manufacturer wants to sell to the consumers. It could be in newspapers, radio, posters, television, internet, notice what ETC. Now, when we have advertisements in newspapers, it means that we only have the visual part. When we have them in radio, means only we have the audio part. And in posters, we have visual part. In television, we have both audio and visual. While in internet, is the same as the television, both audio and visual. And in notice boards on the visual part on the aims of advertisements are one advertisements seek to inform and to persuade the targeted group about a product about an event or a campaign towards a particular product they aim to let the consumers know what goods are being offered now let us look at the characteristics of advertisements. Now, when we're placing an advertisement, it is important first to check on the color of the advertisement. It should be appealing to the eye, it should be catchy to the consumer so that they may be able to be attracted to the product. You should again look at the visual approach. How is your approach towards that particular advertisement? And again, they are not necessarily virtual. The language is catchy and persuasive. The kind of language you use should be catchy and persuasive. They should appeal to the senses of sight and hearing, like we've mentioned here. In newspaper, we will have the sight of the sense of sight, radio, the sense of hearing, poster sense of sight, television will carry both hearing and sight together with the internet, while the notice board will have the sense of sight, that is the visual part. They should have a lasting impression. Will people be able to remember that advertisement? It is because maybe you used beautiful colors, uh, the language was catchy and persuasive, and your visual approach was correct. They are interesting to watch and to listen to. They are brief and punchy. They should not have a lot of information. And they should be clear and easy to understand. Anyone should be able to understand the advertisement without him or her being explained about it. Now let us look at a sample advertisement. We're going to look at an advertisement for a certain school, Institute of uh, Sunshine Institute of Technology in South Africa, just an example. He invites applicants for the following courses, engineering, business administration, hospitality management, computing. The qualifications are mean grade of C plus and above, and applicants or applications should reach before 2nd May of 2022, and this is where you send the application to, and it is only for the qualified candidates only. You will notice that this advert or advertisement of ours is brief and punchy. We have only a few and detailed information. It is clear anyone can understand this that only required or qualified candidates only are required. The qualification is C plus and above. The date the application should reach that office and the courses that are listed. Again, it is interesting to watch. The language is catchy and it is persuasive. And you can see that we have um, the quality of color here, we have color to make it appealing to the eye. So that is it for advertisement. Thank you so much for watching. I hope this helps you to improve on your English. Kindly remember to like, to share and to subscribe. See you in the next one.